when situations are good, you pretend that you are improved. When situations turn against you, you will see who is who. When everything is going well, everybody is fantastic, you know. When life turns against you, still are you fantastic? That's a question. <laughs> I don't know. I think most people take life as it comes. From my experience, you know, I never thought um, any good would ever happen to me. Just from being brought up in my environment, in my neighborhood, that you always saw bad things. People died. It was, either you, it was just normal seeing people die, seeing prostitutes, just seeing that kind of filth and stuff. It was normal. Matter of fact, it was even honorable because it became so um, normal. We normalized it. So it's like this. In the yogic culture, we always use lotus flower as a symbolism for human growth and development. Mm -hmm. Lotus flower grows best wherever filth is really thick. So, uh, why we are using lotus as an example or a symbolism is, this grows well because there is filth. It stays in the filth, but untouched and fragrant. So this is a choice that all of us have. Either we can develop allergy to filth and run away and live in a mountain cave, there also filth will follow you in your head, it won't leave you. Or we can become part of the filth, or we can blossom into your fragrant flower. This is a choice every human being has every moment of their life. Will they exercise this choice? That is a question mark. Yeah, I'm very flowerful. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, definitely are. You definitely are. Sadhguru, how does one begin to read the user manual? So, uh, user's manual means uh, that is a systematic way of observing simple things. When I say simple things, it is a fact that what you call as myself right now is largely the physical body. This is an accumulated dimension of who you are. You gathered it over a period of time, isn't it? Hmm? It's a food that you've eaten, it's just slowly gathered. So this is called as Annamaya Kosha, that means this is a food body. So what kind of food you're putting into your system has a consequence. Well, everybody may have grow up like that, but the question is, is it fulfilling the purpose of being a being, human being, not a human creature, is it supporting your nature of being a human being? That's a question. <laughs>